Hey YouTubers, we're here to show you today how to fill uh, holes with uh, sawdust and wood glue. And as you can see, she's filling in the holes. And this works so much better than a wood putty. It keeps its color. It doesn't look fake. And you're actually putting the, the dust or the wood fiber in the plaque. So the trick to this is you want to use a stainable glue. Um, like your tight bonds and different things like that would be stainable. And I think Elmer's has some wood glues that are stainable. Um, but... Uh, here she's got a little bit of glue in the middle and she's just working the dust into it, making a putty. And then the whole thing is you want to press that in and you want to let it set for about an hour so it can dry out. So, again, that's how to fill walnut using sawdust and wood glue. So this wasn't a very good, uh, probably some one common lumber here that uh, they wanted rustic in a plaque and so um, but they don't want the open you know like down here you can see they're they're kind of open so we're going to go through and we're going to fill that in and then that'll get rid of that and make it look rustic and here she's going to hit it so and that's how it works so just a quick video here to show you guys how it's done and uh, we're getting ready for a warm day here today. Here's a, a walnut dining room table we just refinished. It's got a little dust on it. Wipe the dust off. If you can get a, maybe we can get a glare free view of it here. Turned out absolutely beautiful, so. Anyways, guys, we'll let you go for right now, and stay tuned for more videos. Hey, YouTubers, back here to show you what it looks like sanded. So they're really smooth, and they look like a closed knot, which is exactly what we're looking to do. They just look like a closed knot when you utilize the, the wood putty and glue, the wood, uh, wood dust and glue. So, so again, it's just an awesome way to get a natural look and it doesn't look like the, the manufactured putty.